We have one more thing that sometimes comes up when we go to write down a fraction from an application. Sometimes when we write down fractions, we see what are called signed fractions. What's a signed fraction? Remember that we said in a fraction, the numerator and denominator are whole numbers, and the denominator is not zero. In a complex fraction, the numerator and denominator are allowed to themselves be fractions. In a signed fraction, the numerator and denominator are allowed to be any integers, including negative ones. And a signed complex fraction, well, the numerator and denominator are allowed to be any rational numbers, except the denominator still can't be zero. Okay. Well, what do we do with a signed fraction? If we encounter a signed fraction or a complex fraction, the rules of division tell us whether it's positive or negative. So, for example, 3 halves, of course, is positive. Negative 3 over 2, negative 3 halves, is negative. Positive 3 over negative 2 is also negative, but negative 3 over negative 2 is positive because it's a negative number divided by a negative number. We can also take the opposite of a fraction. So 3 halves is positive. The opposite of 3 halves is negative. Negative 3 halves is negative. The opposite of negative 3 halves is positive. The opposite of 3 over negative 2 is also positive. But the opposite of negative 3 over negative 2 is negative. Notice I've just put these fractions in parentheses so that it's easy to read with that opposite in front. One of the things that we can do if we want to determine really quickly whether a signed fraction is positive or negative is just count the negative signs. If the number of negative signs is even, then the number is positive. Here we see zero negative signs, two negative signs, two negative signs, two negative signs. If the number of negative signs is odd, then the number is negative. Here we have one negative sign, one negative sign, one negative sign, three negative signs. To quickly determine whether the number is positive or negative, just count the number of negative signs.